Hi guys, this is JNM with a new Blender video on how to write an add-on to symmetrize meshes for different axes. I added the feature to my fast carve add-on. In the panel on the left you can see 6 buttons to symmetrize the selected object. I switch to edit mode now and add an edge loop and then I extrude out a face here in the direction of the negative x axis. Ok, then I switch to object mode and to symmetrize the whole object to the right side I press minus x for negative x symmetry. This will also work for more complex objects, for example let's cut a hole here into the mesh by adding a cylinder and then use the difference operation. You can add a bevel to the object as well and after that press the minus x button to symmetrize. Here we go. The same works for other axes. Let's move the mesh in edit mode a bit upwards so that the origin stays at the center and then return to object mode and press the set button to symmetrize the parts of the positive set axis. Alright, so let's open the text editor and have a look at the Python code. In the init file of the addon I imported and registered a new operator called fc underscore symmetrize operator. This is a Python class derived from operator and it has a string property that defines the axis for which the symmetrize operation should be done. The default value is negative x. I set the property to hidden because I don't want it to appear in the operators panel, I just want to control the operation with the 6 buttons. In the execute method of the operator I switch to edit mode, select all polygons, then call the symmetrize method for the axis defined by the string property and finally I return to object mode. The 6 buttons that call the operator I added to my panel class. I create 2 rows. Each row has three columns with the buttons. And as you can see here I set the sim axis property for each operator. So the first operator will do a symmetrize for negative x, the second one for negative y and so on and so forth. This is how you parameterize your operator so you don't have to write a new one for each axis. The fastcarve add-on can be downloaded for free from my github. This is the page, I added the link to the description below. So guys, I hope you find this useful and interesting and if you like my channel, please don't forget to subscribe. If you would like to support my add-on and help my channel grow, please consider supporting me on my Patreon. Thanks for watching this, thanks for your support and see you soon here on JNM.